Pack your bags. You're going to ghoul school. What's going on everybody? Mark Conlon with your MHN Horror Fact of the Day. Today continues our Halloween Horror Nights Fact Week, where I provide interesting facts on Halloween Horror Nights. Today's fact is on the Ghoul School. But before I get to that fact, if you could be so awesome to stab that like button, smash that subscribe, and click that little dingy bell to be notified every time we drop amazing content right here in MHN. Now back to the facts. In 1994, as Halloween Horror Nights was growing in popularity and solidifying themselves as a premier Halloween destination, they started to advance Halloween Horror Nights and develop new concepts to keep pushing the envelope and keep the event moving forward and moving up and becoming bigger and better. With the addition of Scare Zones and also the Chainsaw Crew, yeah, they're really awesome. That's like the first sound you hear when you walk in through the metal detectors. Yes, there's metal detectors. They want to make sure their actors don't get stabbed or shot. But you, that's the first thing you hear is, is Chainsaw Sauce. It's awesome. It's fantastic. It's you right in the mood right away. They also created the Ghoul School with the addition of the scare zones and adding more houses every year. They knew they would need to hire more actors. They also knew that they wanted the actors to have the best quality performance that were up to the standards of Universal Studios. So they created what they called the Ghoul School, where actors would audition for these roles, and then when they would get cast around August, they would go into Ghoul School. So Universal Studios was able to ensure that their acting performance was top notch. And they had a golden quality across the board, which they still do to this day, which is awesome. Good on you, Universal, for having a quality and standard. I appreciate that. That's that's awesome. It makes my experience as a guest feel valued. I feel valued. Thank you, Universal. I feel validated by Universal. Maybe I'll feel a little, a little bit more special than I normally do. <laughs> that's That's... That's really sad. And that has been your MHN Horror Fact of the Day, and I have a comments challenge for all of you. What's the most committed acting performance that you've ever seen in a haunted house or a Halloween haunted event of some kind? I, of course, will pick the very best comment, and that person will choose a future topic for a future episode of MHN Horror Fact of the Day. Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>there's actually a really bunch of you know, funny YouTube videos of, of people going through this school and they're not in makeup or anything they're just kind of walking around in the regular clothes <laughs> and and um, you know and doing training you know it's kind of fun like it's it's an interesting thing because like when you're not in the makeup and the costumes you it kind of look ridiculous the um uh, you know I know there's a photo of me somewhere um uh, you know pretending to be a zombie in one of the movies with with no makeup and no costume just just me you know in a t-shirt and pair of jeans, the <laughs> and it looks ridiculous, uh, just like everybody else.